never seen that before. I've seen mountains like this before. Ones with the snow on top of them. You have? These are the Aheed Mountains. They should extend all the way to the northern border of Trekur. Then let's traverse the tops of them to get there. How are we supposed to do that when they're blanketed in snow? It'll be near impossible to find the trail. But with the war, crossing over from Rasulia will be even more difficult, right? With you here, Victor, we should be able to find the trail without any issues. No, we shouldn't. I've never had any occasion to go to Trekur before. <sighs> Then I guess it's out of the question. Wait a minute. I know what route to take. How would you know that? Um, by using my own form of signaturgy? Signaturgy? Preposterous! There can't be any signaturgy that allows one to discover unknown routes because... He meant it as a figure of speech. I apologize for any misconceptions he caused by using that word. Anne and I can find how to get there, trust me. Just who are the two of you, anyway? First, you have the same weapon as the enemy. And now you make this outrageous statement? Come to think of it, they just appeared out of the blue. And why did you try to give Relia to the enemy against our wishes? If you're so knowledgeable about signets, Anne, how come no one at the Institute knows you? And we could go on. Everyone, please, take a step back. Emerson, I can't help but be skeptical of you as well. You guys are definitely harboring some secrets. And you feel that you can't share them with us. There's no doubting that. Uh. However, you put your life on the line to fight for us. And you've saved Relia more than once. Furthermore, you broke some law in order to help us, even though Anne tried to stop you at first. So you overheard us then? I'm sure it was imperative you adhere to it. But you decided that protecting Relia was even more important. I have a hunch you'll do it again if need be. It's almost as if you can see right through us. I've made my decision and I believe in you. All right, everyone. We're crossing the mountains into Trey Kerr. This is as far as I can accompany you. From here, I must head back to Rasulia. But we... If Santarol were attacked, I would want to return as well. What would you do if it were Stahl? I... I guess I see your point. Thank you for coming with us as far as you did. Thank you, Mr. Soldier. I said some rather harsh things to you back there, but... Don't sweat it. Water under the bridge. I trust that you will keep everyone else safe. Of course I will. Bye-bye, Mr. Soldier.
Ready to retire yet? So, it's about time you showed up. I'd be much more excited if it had been a lady waiting for us. I don't think I need to tell you why I'm here, you damned worms. We're not giving you really a... Do I have to explain to you idiots again that it's pointless to resist? The half-wit with the potty mouth is making another empty threat. I'm so scared. You waste a Federation space! You'll pay for that remark! Force me! Wipe these filthy chimps out! Hey, what's going on up there, Vorsny? Vorsny! Vorsny here. Three Federation ships have entered this sector. They have their shields enabled and are preparing to engage. We cannot offer any support at the moment. Wait, what was that? I have bad news, sir. We've detected transport signals emanating from the enemy starships. Impossible! How the tables have turned. You damned cheaters! Who violated protocol first? Oh, that's right, you. You want bearable little... Really, it belongs to us. Give her up! Please, hold on to real What are you doing? It's my life! I not Marvelous! Yeah. <laughs> 
Miki! Miki! This injury is not just external. There's damage to her viscera too, I think. Wait a second! That had breached the U! Boss, Miki's hurt. Avine's attack has her in critical condition. She's got tachycardia. There's more. Hypotension has set in as well. And of all of us here, she's the only one who can heal the harmed. There's no such equipment or cadre that'd allow her to come back. You can't aid her at all? That's just... You're saying we wait until she dies? What are you thinking? I suggest that we all transport. In order to rescue Miki, the Gull's equipment is integral. Surely you understand the consequences of this. Means breaking the UP3. Article 1 to start, I would assume. Emerson to the Charles D. Goal. Do you read? Yes, sir. What's the issue? I need you to send the nine of us to your location now. At nine, sir? That many? Wait a second! That had breached the- Unique situation. Do it. Aye, aye, sir. Starting transport now. Take her by stretcher to sickbay. <sighs> Miki. To sickbay. Please come right away. Deck twelve, sick bay. I'll take it from here. We're counting on you. Will Miki be all right? She's undergoing treatment now. How's Miki? Her vital signs have stabilized, so she'll be fine. She'll be back to her old self in a few days. <laughs> Thanks so much. And to the bridge. Miki's condition has now stabilized. That is great news. Now you can invite everyone else up here. Understood, Emerson. You can call me Captain now. But Emerson's not half bad. How could I make such a mistake? I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> I'll be up here. I'll take you there. Bridge. Well then, so where should we start? We'll answer anything we are allowed to. I'll go first. What is this place? It's rather difficult to explain, but we often refer to it as a ship. 
A ship. Hmm. Who knew there were such advanced civilizations outside the Vestilian continent? You're not from Hadamal, then, are you? No, we're not. But how do I put this? We come from a place that none of you have ever heard of. Hmm. I see. Discoveries truly do await us around every corner. Maybe he was right when he told me that field work is of the utmost import. This is moving as we speak? Indeed. Your civilization is so much more advanced than ours in Santorol. I'm kind of shocked, but I have to say it's also an honor to be the only one at the Institute to experience this. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our humble Charles D. Gold. It can't be. Is this a map? Smart, stylish, and intuitive. You are a triple threat. This was our location before we were transported here. And this is the Trekur region. We think this is where Little Miss Starlight came from. Where I came from? Of all the areas within the continent's arid region from which the snowy Aheeds are visible, I'd say it's most probable that she's from this one. There's no electromagnetic response from anywhere in it, though. The facility could very well be cloaked. I suppose. If that's true, then we've no choice but to investigate it ourselves. And Miki? You can trust that our medical technology will safely revive her. All right, I will. Delacroix, prepare to transfer. Aye, aye. Anne, take us to the transport room. Yes, sir. And we're off. Pardon me. The transporter on deck two. You've gotten better at making the right decision, I see. You call violating the UP3 the right decision? Sometimes the rules are worth breaking. I still don't fully comprehend why. But somehow, I knew that was the only choice I could make. Your understanding of it needn't be complete. As long as you know what it means to hold people's lives in your hands. Please follow me. 